and let me take you through my personal TF2 loadouts. Now, if I sound a little bit tired, it's because I am tired. I am. <laughs> school has been riding me lately, but I've wanted to make this for a while now, so. Um, and also, one other thing is that Engineer is the only class that has loadouts through A to D, but. Anyways, so for Scout, I just use mostly stock, except I use the Boston Basher because I'm not that bad at hitting my Scout melees. So it's, if anything, it's better than stock. Um, then I use my Unusual and the Juvenile's Jumper and the Marksman. I use the uh, the Marksman on a lot, a lot of classes because it just looks so stupid. But yeah, scout's pretty average. Mostly stock. Most most of my cla class use stock. For soldier, I use the rocket launcher, the conjurer, and the escape plan. Sometimes I'll use the shotgun, but lately I've been using the conch. Um, and I don't know. It's just, I like that passive health. Plus, you don't need to deal as much damage in order to get full uh, rage or whatever the thing at the corner is called. But I do also occasionally use stock, because again, just backup d damage deal. Uh, pyro. I usually use the degreaser, shock, shotgun, and power deck. Um, I use shotgun on a lot of classes. I love the shotgun. It's just really good, just consistent damage. I love the uh, quick switch of this. It's just same like shooting someone in the distance or whatever with the shotgun, and then someone just. You know, fires like a, a rocket at me. I can just like quickly like reflect it back over. And they're dead. Everything's done. Power jack. You know, increased movement speed, which is really really good for pyro. Um. Now for demo, my normal loaders are usually like hybrid knight, and sometimes I will use the iron bomber. I, I mean. If, I, if anything, I like usually use the Iron Bomber, but I find lately, again, I've been using the uh, gr grenade launcher. It's just, again, there's no downsides to it. Stock is just great, but I used to always use the Iron Bomber. Sometimes I will use the loose cannon because, come on, it's the, it's the loose cannon. Now, for heavy, this is actually the wrong loadout. Go to A. Here we go. So, I love using the K KGB with the, with the Tommy slot because if I can get crits with this, this is so powerful. And then I use the the banana a lot more over the uh, sandwich because I mean it's just so useful. The fact that it recharges so fast and it gives you 200 health and but though if we don't have a medic on the team i will use the sandwich but nine times out of ten i'll be running the the banana now for the class we've all been waiting for engineer so for engineer pretty much here is how my low loadouts go we got speed more or less the average engineer loadout we got Rest Ranger, Wrangler, and Jag, and my also my strange PDA, which was a gift to me from F Future Tense. So, everyone who's watching this, go sub to F Future Tense. He makes amazing content, puts a lot of effort into it, and he he deserves more more attention. So, I'll link him in the uh, d d description. So, this is just all around just good speed with good defense then I have the Eureka effect for the Jag effect rollout um, that's really all, all I use this one for for C this is for just full-on defense if I want to have really good like building uh, survivability also as I said with my stock wrench video the stock wrench is a perfect balance between speed and like survivability and it's stock, albeit, I won't lie, the Jag is still really good, but stock. Also, Australian, so. 
And then for D is my battle engineer. Now, usually I'm actually using the frontier justice because I'm not bad with the mini placement. So I just run the frontier justice because then I can get, you know, crits, just unload them into people. And then I use the pistol because, well, you know, this only has three shots. So I use the pistol just for backup dam damage dealing. Um, now for medic. I use the normal medic loaded with the crossbow, medigun, and the uber saw. It's just too good not to use. And also, a fun little little note about medic. So, with my old loadout, um, I had different hats for every class or whatever. Um, and I actually got the winter woodsman. Not 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 this like unusual winter woodsman but i got the winter woodsman for my medic which is to make this loadout but then i like this hat so much that i put it on every class and then i got this aces high so you know there's that so yeah that's the story of how i got the winter woodsman or got into using the winter woodsman now this is my sniper um again the normal sniper loadout it's just sniper rifle with the Bushwalker Jurati combo. This is just so good. And as a sni sniper, you shouldn't really be right out, out in the front line, so you wouldn't really need to use like an SMG. So I just use the Jurati with this. Sometimes I will use the classic because, you know, classic good, as my guy, dude, the ninja says. Um, now for spy, um, I wear my clan pride with my boy Leo. Look at him right there. Um, we're that on my spy. Then I use this loadout. I like the extra health for this because anytime I get one kill I die instantly. So I just I used to always just run this. But now I'm always running this. It's just so useful. And because I'm not that bad at getting my first backstab. And yeah. Those were my wait, I'll go over to Ng. Yeah, those were my TF2 loadouts for 2019 to 2020 and look at that this video this it's only been about eight, seven and a half minutes or so so I don't know how people can lengthen this out to half an hour anyways that was it no it's short but who likes a long loadout video hope you enjoyed and I will see you in the next video also I'm trying to get to 1000 subs by the end of the year so anyways I'll see you in the next video. Adios.